what are the key innovations that need to happen to reduce the cost of electrolyzers globally and to make green hydrogen more viable? There are a few different types of electrolyzers. And historically, a lot of research has focused on making electrolyzers more efficient. And that's really important because the more efficient you can make your electrolyzer, the less energy you have to use to make your hydrogen. But we're actually getting pretty good at this now. So we're, I mentioned that it takes 50 kilowatt hours a kilogram to make hydrogen. The theoretical minimum that we physically can't go below is 40 kilowatt hours. So we're actually pretty close already. So there's not a huge amount of breakthrough tech that we can make to make it take less energy. That's just a fundamental. But we can make electrolyzers that are cheaper and we can make electrolyzers that require less maintenance and less degradation because these things have to be replaced as you make more hydrogen, they kind of erode and, and degrade. So making stable electrolyzers that are cheap, that can be transported into different places or can be situated in different places and matched well with both their supply so they can cope with spiky power from renewables as well as output hydrogen at the right pressure and the right conditions that is needed.